camera up. Set this camera up. I don't even know what I'm doing today. It's like just a bit of a weird day today. We're only going to get like a couple of hours. Uh, so I thought I'd just quickly come out here nice and close. And um, hopefully this wind doesn't pick up too much. But yeah, so we'll see how we go. I don't even know what I'm going to do. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock on the dock. I'll probably catch a fish on that, eh? It's pretty rusty anyway, it's not gonna matter. How would I touch a hook? Touch something here. Is that gonna be too rusty though? Good point, that might be a bit sharp, eh? Ooh, give that a go, eh? You reckon? You <laughs> catch your feet on that? Unless that's going to be too sharp in there, but let's give it a go. How would you even do it? What have I got in here? What have I got? There. Just go like this. Let me just go like this. Yes, that'll work all right, eh? I'll stick that off. <laughs> stick that on there. Right, and then we might just tie a loop knot straight to that and <laughs> try and catch a fish on it. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. That's what we're doing today. Stupidness. Doing stupid stuff. <laughs> what do I got in here? Oh, yeah. Um, I wonder if, how do I get that onto there? That one get onto there, that'll warp. That'll warp the hell out of it. We'll just see, we'll just see how we go. Give me five seconds. See what we can do here. Take this fella off. No way you're gonna get that over there. Ugh. No way that's going on there. So what? What I just do is do this. Let's just do it this way. Loop knot onto here, and then whoop, in there like that. What do you reckon? That might do it, eh? That might do it. Catching. This is a little bit short. I, have, I don't think I've got any longer ones, but we should be right. We'll, we'll catch something on it. <laughs> we'll give it a red hot crack anyway. These ones longer, huh? These ones. Look at these two other ones. They might be longer. This one might be a bit longer. It's rusty, but suits the rest of it. It's rusty. That'd be any longer. Yeah, that one's a bit. Oh, not by much. Not by much, but it's a tad longer. Let's just run. Let's run two on there. Let's just run two. See how that goes. All right, so I come out here. Got this little Jimmy rigged up here. So the ridiculousness of it is just next level. Ever since I've done that sprite cam pop of it, everyone's like, duh. More of this, more of this. So, this is the most ridiculous thing I could find this morning to put hooks on. So, uh, let's get into it. We'll try a couple of different retrieves, see if we can get a bite. So, let's do it. Here they are, big school under me. Big school underneath me here, coming through. No, I'm not massive, but. Phew, 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 phew. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, seven fish. Seven or so. See if they want a bite. I should. Really use a jigging rod if I'm gonna do this. But that's alright. We'll persevere. It's not real jigging. I think 
we can't get too technical if we're like, yeah, I use a jigging rod. And if I'm using a spanner as a lure, that's, it's just, you can't be too technical when, you, <laughs> when you're using spanners for lures. Put a bit of a speculator out this side. Ah, oh, they're just sort of coming through on that side. That's all right. There we go. Saw him at that hey big dog. <laughs> big dog. Come on up. Where you get shark, Bryson? Come back up. Sharks will be on you. I can get you in, smoke you in. Come on, sharks will be on you soon. He's a good dog, that one. Good dog. Come on, bro. He took it like a train. He's gonna come up. Hey -ya. I was hooked on the fin. There he goes. He's hooked on the Whew. I saw him he's hooked like underneath on the of the mouth. So yeah, there's plenty of his mates down there too. Tons, tons of his mates down there. Whew. But I had a giant school just under me and my camera decided to play up, so that's that's sick. Things always decide to stop working when there's bulk fish around. Which is a very annoying but luckily, we're back on track. had to give that spanner a bit of action. That's a queenie, it's coming up the jump. Surely queenie. A small one. It's a small one, hey? Or is it a small? No, it's a queenie. He's alright, yeah. He's got a mate. What's going on? That's the lamest jump I've ever seen. There you go, spanner. Look at this guy, straight up to the boat. Come on. Oh, you're going to take off now. Quick. Hey! <laughs> On the spanner! I just had to give that spanner a bit of, a bit of work. Full of beans. Full of beans. Quick. No, right, quick, 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 quick. Come up here. Come up here, man. That's you. You're good. You're good, you're good, you're good. You're good, spanner boy. There we go, spanner boy. Yes, on the spanner. How good is that? I got both hooks in him too. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, took a while. There we go, on the spanner. Look at that. Good job, mate. Good one, about a metre. Whew. Look at that. Look at that. On the spanner. How good. Go, swim Queenie, swim. Real quick with the Queenies, hey, they, you keep them for too long in the boat, out of the water, they're a bit sooky, they will die, so. How good. What about my loop? Not, no, it's good. Well, it's got a little bit of chafe there, but, like tiniest bit of chafe, but yeah, we're good, man. That's, that's worked a treat. Except when I was warning it flat out, like if I just straight wind it, it wasn't really doing anything, it was just going through the water. So what I was doing then, is I was just giving it a little bit of a jiggle as I wind, so it would sort of go like this as I wind it. But that's the kind of little trick there. Either that or I should peg it at one of these big pylons and try and bend it a little bit. So just it's got that little bit of resistance, but if I just jig my rod tip, it seemed to be, seemed to be working. So see if we can get another one, prove it wasn't a fluke. 
to land another one anyway. Big your boys. Jiggy, seems to be a few here. Seems to be a few here in the sounder, a couple of lines and stuff. Whew, she hot. She hot, boys and girls. She hot, baby. She hot. Drop it down, you can see them down there at about 10 metres. 10 metres, there's a couple swimming through there. Oh, and the bottom, look at that, down to 15 metres. Oh, what's that? Tunies. Tunas over there. Do you reckon you can cast that far? I reckon I can. Oh, tunas over there. Yep, I reckon you can cast that far, eh? I reckon you can. Ah! Ooh, cast like a dream. Yep, tuna, come on. Tunies, come on, tunies. Tunies, 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 no. No tunies on it. They're a bit far away. Tuna, notoriously picky eaters. Tunies. <sighs> you gonna eat there, little tune boys? Oh, they're only small. Oh, these are mackerel. Oh. Come on. He's following, 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 following. Ah, what happened? Turned away. Yeah. Oh, that was a hit. Hit. Hit in the middle. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that little jiggy, fast jiggy wind action. That's a queen fish for sure, I reckon. Yep, he's coming up, he's coming up, he's coming up, come on. Come here, come on. He's coming up, oh, he's going on. Ah, he's going down, he's going down. Come on up. No, 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 come up, come up. At least get on top. Oh, he's big too. He's big, he's big, big. Oh. Big one, big angry one. Oh, Jesus, I love a spanner. Oh yes, good one. Oh, on the spanner. Hey, come here, come here, come here, come here. Got him good. Woo, you went hard, bro. Hey, you went hard. Yeah, yeah. Oh, come here. Come here, come here. Oh, stop it. It's been terrible. There he is. Another one on the spanner. How's that? How's that for the spanner? <laughs> How good is that? Oh, he hammered it too. He hammered it, the old spanner jig. The old spanny jig. Now I need to get a Spanish on the Spanish jig. On the spanner jig. Oh, got him good there, eh? Got him there. Two hooks. Perfect. Now we get these guys back in really quick. Especially these bigger ones. Probably just do it like that, can't I? Just like that. Perfect. Stop, stop, stop. You want to release these while they've still got a lot of energy because, see, he's like perfect. Um, a bit fragile, the queenies, if you keep them out of the water too long. But yeah, spanner jig. Perfect. Available now at your local Mitre 10. Oh, Bunnings. Well, I think I've proved my point, and um, my arm's kind of tired, so <laughs> I'm going to call it there. So get your spanners out. I want to see them. Um, get it done. Spanner jigs, spanner, what? I don't even know what we're going to call them. What do you reckon we should call them? The Drew M. Spanner jigger. So, anyways, I'll see you in the next one.